All right, today we're here on the Mack truck with Kyle Jones. What's up, Kyle? Nah, not too much. You excited about being on YouTube for the first time? I am. Yes. You know, it's not the first time people have seen your face on TV. You know, your mug shots are pretty infamous. Sure I'm kidding. Is. He's not a mug shot <laughs> guy. So the reason why we're on the truck today is Kyle's got something kind of cool I'm going to show you guys. And he was gracious enough to let us on board. So let's go take a look at that. Check out this. This is a Mac Edge toolbox made in USA, right? Now, something pretty cool about this one is it comes preloaded, right? It's got picks and screwdrivers. These are kind of, um, these are considered mini pry bars, in my opinion. Kidding. It actually does have mini pry bars right here. All in foam. Look at that. Plastic scraper, regular scraper, hose picks. It's like a starter set, right? Check out the drawer as it closes. It's got like cruise control on it, right? So we open up this drawer, next drawer down. We have some quarter inch drive sockets and metric and standard. I don't know if these are 12 points or not. They're all six point, it looks like. We've got a Mac access ratchet, regular quarter inch ratchet. Some really nifty looking line wrenches. I kind of like the offset on these line wrenches like that. And then he's got those in both metric and standard. Some L keys, some torch drives, some E torques, some other E torques. Some other torques. All right, you get the joke. You got the, is there any torques plus in here? I don't see any torques plus. But they're all in foam, which is very cool. Now watch, I'm gonna slam this drawer, you ready? Check it out, not bad. Next drawer down, ooh, look at that. These are uh, the Mac Precision Torque. It's an inch and a quarter. This set is SCE on this side. It goes from quarter inch all the way up to inch and a quarter. On the right side, the metric from six to 19. Pretty good set. Watch once again. Check it out. No shake, rattle, and roll. Next one down with three eight sockets, standard metric, deep, shallow. Look, feeler gauges. They got thread gauges, got tired up gauges, thermometer. Got you a nice Stanley Fat Max tape. Speed wrench. Check it out. Hey, we know that guy. Some spark plug sockets, mirror, magnet, caliper. Everything you would need to start, you know, start wrenching. Pretty good set. Pretty good set. Once again, no slamming. Oh, half inch drawer. Now check it out. Some more half inch ratchets. There's a flex head ratchet there. There's a universal. You can't put an impact on it, but you can use a, a regular socket and ratchet and extension combo. Some good uh, breaker bar, a short ratchet, metric, standard, all in foam. All with the no slam drawer. We get down here to our pliers and our hammer. We have an anti-vibe hammer with some punches and chisels. We got a non-marring drift. I'm not gonna call it brass, we'll call it non-marring alloy drift. Some water pump pliers. These are side cutters. You know, you get the rest of the deal. These are some more water pump type pliers. Those are like those um, hose bent pliers. Wire strippers, some big pliers, vice grips. Snap ring pliers. And bottom drawer leaves you more stuff. And you get the little templates here. So you can you know, decide how you want to put it. Once again, boom. Done, done slam. All right, so Kyle, that's a pretty good set. That's a good starter set, right? A like yeah, guy that's been in the trade for maybe a few months, maybe a year or two, something like that. He wants to step up from like some Harbor Freight tools, get some USA made professional type tools. That's right. Pretty excited about that box. Very nice set. And you make deals, right? I so, make deals. So anybody in the Austin area or Kyle's route that wants to come and buy this from him, he'll get you a good deal, right? That's right. So he can't sell it to you if you don't live in the area, but if you live in the area, you're on his route, Kyle's going to hook you up and make you a good deal. Kyle, thanks a lot. Thank you for letting us film on your truck. No problem. Kyle. Maybe in the future we'll do a tool or a tool truck tour. Are you down for that? I'm down for All it. All right. He's got he's to put some stuff away, but... The truck's in pretty good shape, but, you know, it could be better. I'm kidding. That's right. He, Kyle and I are pretty good friends. So thanks a lot to Kyle. We'll see you next time. See you guys.